Hello everyone, welcome to my channel Selenium Tech Automation. So in this today video, I am going to discuss about a very very important interview question that is called as how to explain about your project. Okay, so during your interview, if interviewer will ask you about, tell me about your project details means many of the candidates are failing to answer it properly. Okay, even though if they are experienced candidates also, so they are failing to explain it properly. Okay, when they are uh, going for the or when they are moving to some other companies. And also this question is applicable for freshers as well. Okay, so first of all, we need to remember even as a attendee, I know very well. Okay, we have to think in this way. I know very well, rather I mean I know very well than that particular interviewer okay so the concepts what you know maybe that interviewer will don't know okay we have to think always in this way only while you are attending for any interview okay even that interviewer will also have some knowledge but we are the candidates where we are preparing for our interviews before attending for an interview then we are attending for an interview okay so but that interviewer will always focus on his current work only okay so during that time we need to think we know everything that interviewer don't know anything okay in this way only we have to think when attending for interviews okay so let's get started so to explain about your current project or your project means we need to follow some tips or advices okay so the first tip here is our explanation will be in a very very shorter way okay our explanation will be in a very shorter way so in that shorter way means so we have to explain it everything in a short time okay we have to explain it everything in a short time about your project details and also it will be in a clear way okay first we need to prepare before attending for an interview first we can note down all our uh, i mean all our points regarding to our project so then we are going to answer these to our interview in a clear way okay some people what they will do if interviewer ask like tell me about your pro project means so they can start like this uh, current pro my i mean in my current project i am doing uh, this so and so and also we have these many modules and also we have uh, i mean some project specification terms will be there right so we no need to we no need to tell all these project terms and all of about our project details to that particular interviewer okay try to avoid to answer all these details to your interviewer we can tell it in a shorter way so what is what like i am working with this particular banking project we have these many models currently i am automating this one and also we have uh, for every one month or two months we have uh, we have these many releases and also i am working on this particular model and we are performing some regression testing so that's it we now need to define everything like each and everything to that particular entry over so that too he he don't need all these inputs from your end okay so if we explain like this means so then that interviewer will keep on expecting many many answers from your end means he will keep on digging some answers to you i mean some questions to you okay during that time we may fail to answer each and every question what interviewer is expecting okay then the next one here is we need to choose okay first we need to choose our current project okay as an experienced guy if i am attending for an interview like more than eight years so i may work with multiple projects for example uh, three to six projects i have worked or three to five projects i have worked where i am having eight years of experience okay so we need to ignore all our previous projects first we need to choose our the current project only okay first choose the current project and then answer it in a very shorter way and also it will be in a very clear way okay so then when you come to the freshers means so whatever they have completed their project during their final year that should be enough to answer for this question during their interview okay so keep that in mind you can always choose your current project for an experienced candidates and also for freshers whatever the project you have completed during your final year when you are studying so that should be enough for the interview okay 
so these are all the three tips we need to remember the first one is our next our explanation should be in a shorter way and also it in it is very clear way okay so the next one is first we need to choose our current project then for fresher if you are a fresher means you need to explain about the project where you completed during your studying in final year okay these three tips we need to follow while answering this question so then on top of it we need to add some more points here first we need to specify the name of the project and what is your domain okay first specify your project name and specify your domain name as well so later we can give some brief introduction what is that project purpose example okay what is the purpose of that particular project for example if i can say like a erp project what is its purpose okay where end user can uh, buy some products from that particular application such as uh, applications called amazon or flipkart or uh, mintra something okay so these are all comes under the erp project first we need to give some brief introduction about our application so then what is the purpose of that particular project okay so after that we need to keep in mind so there is one more point that is called as tools okay uh, using of which tool we are automating this particular application and also using of which technology we are using uh, for this application and also where we automated this application such as platform and also what kind of process we are following if you can say process means here uh, agile process okay agile process we are following in my current project and what is its type of architecture that is three tier or two tier okay so i can say here the architecture type will be the three and my client is so and so so then coming to the next point we need to define our team size okay uh, my team size is, my team size is eight members okay out of eight members there are two are from manual testers and three are from manual testers and one lead one manager okay and one on-site manager okay and uh, my project is uh, since from last uh, couple of years like uh, five years or six years or ten years my project is going on like ten years since from last ten years this project is going on okay so now this project is going to be end in couple of months so that's why i'm looking for better uh, opportunity where my profile is suitable with okay so then the next point we need to remember here is what is your role okay my my role here is my role here is whenever there are some new functionalities are coming whenever there are some new technologies are implementing first i am willing to learn all those technologies and i am willing to learn all those function uh, new functionalities which are to be implemented okay and also so i i faced many challenges like handling the dynamic experts and also handling the multiple windows and also handling uh, the main uh, i mean synchronization conditions means wait conditions okay and also these are all my contributions as a team member and also there are some interesting facts to be expected from our side okay as a lead if you are a lead as a lead i handle this much team size and daily we have these many status calls and for every month we have these many releases and these many sprints okay so these and all we have to uh, remember in our mind okay when you are at when you are answering the question like tell me about your project so then you can easily crack your interview with this question okay it is a starting question before entry you are asking for uh, the next questions okay i hope this video will help you at least two to three percent if you found it this video is helpful so please drop a like to this video and please uh, share this video to your friends or colleagues so that youtube will recommend this video for more people okay and also please subscribe to my channel if you are new to here okay so that's all it for now thanks for watching have a nice day signing off selenium tech automation